Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2 2022. I think a lot of people that are watching this are going to feel similar to how I have felt the last few years and installments in this franchise in that you play the game, you enjoy it for a little bit, and then the last half of it, you really don't pick it up that much or you don't really enjoy it. And then when that new game gets announced, you stand in front of that mirror, you put that clown makeup on, and you stand there smiling like an idiot. Well, today, we are all gathered here today to be clowns staring in that mirror smiling like an idiot call of duty modern warfare 2 2022 worldwide reveal trailer five four three two one going dark oh that was cool <laughs> Okay, we're inverted. Hey, I like that. I like that. We got Shout out to me. <laughs> we can't take him in Iran. He's not in Iran. Now, I assume this is going to be a lot of campaign. Looks good, as you would expect. And I believe this is supposed well, to be... On a new engine, if I'm not mistaken. Which is surprising, because I thought the Modern Warfare 2019 engine was great. Interesting. Dynamic environments, huh? They do such a good job of getting you hyped, though, man. <laughs> they do so good. Mexican Special Forces, 141, they are your brothers now. And they really are pushing the team aspect in this game, which makes me wonder how they're going to do to the open beta, how they're going to do the campaign. OK, well, we really didn't see anything. Truthfully, it just kind of made me hype because of the way they did the cinematics of it all. I guess that's it. Now, granted, this is just a, a worldwide reveal trailer and we're not going to see much. I'm sure we'll get a gameplay trailer and all that here very, very soon. Um, you know, for me, I'm just waiting. I, I, you know, I'm, I got the clown makeup on. I'll admit it. But uh, for me, Modern Warfare 2019 was one of my least favorite games in the franchise. And I thought the potential for the game was the best out of any game in the franchise. But it missed fundamentally with spawns, maps, skill base, and just the way that it allowed a certain play style to really just have no counter and just run rampant. Just It was not for me. But if they can fix some of those things, um, it could be really, really good. Because that I will admit, Modern Warfare 2019 did a lot of the little things right. It just felt like they missed on a lot of the big fundamentals for me. So yeah, there you go. Uh, not really much. There's not really anything else to talk about. But best believe that there's more info and more things for us to react to. We'll definitely be reacting to. Okay, leave a like. Bye!